Has this ever happened to you? In this video, we make a simple DIY door alarm using a new Demia magnet, reed switch, and Raspberry Pi computer to send an email or text whenever a door is open. It's not a great security system, but it's a great demo that has many applications. How does it work? Using a reed switch, which is a magnetically activated switch, we can open and close the circuit, setting off a buzzer or alarm when the door opens. Using the smarts of the Pi, we can then send an email or a text whenever the door opens. We wrote a Python script that can run continuously on the Pi to monitor the condition of the door. You can download a copy of our script in the description below. Here you can see the main setup and schematic. A Pi is powered by a nearby wall outlet. Using a 40 pin input output cable, we hook the Pi to a breadboard. From there, the circuit runs through a reed switch, a few resistors, and a buzzer. It's quite simple. When the door is closed, the magnet closes the reed switch, telling our circuit that the door is closed. When the door is opened and the magnet is removed, the reed switch opens, telling our circuit and Pi that the door is open. Here we test a few different magnet sizes to show how close a certain magnet needs to be to the reed switch to close it. All of the magnets we are using have their magnetization through the longest dimension and parallel to the reed switch. Inch. Yeah, it comes in at an inch, it doesn't matter if you're closer. But it comes out further out. It's important that the magnetization direction remains parallel to the reed switch. If the magnetization direction is perpendicular, even a strong That's magnet open. needs to get very close to the switch to activate it. That's closed. Good to us. We hope you enjoyed this short video. This simple demo could be used for many things like alerting you if your basement floods by putting the magnet and reed switch on a sub pump. Length, right? yeah. Leave a comment for other uses for this sort of thing. Be sure to check the description for links to the parts we used in our circuit. Also, make sure to subscribe to catch our monthly videos.